St. Lucia's tourism sector has received a shot in the arm with the reopening of a major source market. We get details from Jerrine Georges of the St. Lucia Tourism Authority. Commemorating the reopening of the Canadian market, the St. Lucia Tourism Authority, along with tourism stakeholders, were on hand at the Huronar International Airport to welcome Air Canada Rouge Flight 1878 on Sunday, October 3rd. The return of Air Canada signals the reopening of St. Lucia's fourth largest international source market. Air Canada discontinued its winter service to St. Lucia in January 2021 during the third wave of the COVID-19 pandemic. The first flight to St. Lucia returns after nine months following the Canadian government's cancellation of all flights to Mexico and the Caribbean in February 2021. To welcome Air Canada, a delegation led by Tourism Minister Honorable Dr. Ernest Hilaire comprised the Chairman of the Board of Directors at the St. Lucia Tourism Authority, Thaddeus Antoine, the St. Lucia Air and Seaports Authority, and President of the St. Lucia Hospitality and Tourism Association, Paul Collimore. The flight landed at 2 p.m., bringing a combined total of 148 returning nationals and visitors to the island. A commemorative plaque was presented to Captain Christopher Clark and crew members who disembarked to greet the delegation. Till the end of October, it's going to be one flight a week. Thereafter, it's going to be two flights a week. And from the middle of December, we're going to be having four flights per week. Certainly, we are delighted to have so many visitors that will be coming to our shores. That adds more business to the taxis, to the sites and attractions, to the hotels, to the restaurants. And all the other sectors in Central will surely benefit from having more visitors coming in. And of course, we all know that so many persons depend on the tourism sector for employment. And ahead of Christmas, we're certainly looking forward to flights full coming out of Canada. Air Canada's return service to Toronto on Sunday, October 3rd, departed with 51 passengers and facilitated the exportation of 2,545 pounds of fresh produce to Canada. President of the St. Lucia Hospitality and Tourism Association, Paul Collimore, speaks of the benefit of another market to St. Lucia. This opportunity with having another source market reopen provides that opportunity for them to have the flights to come back to St. Lucia. Also, we see this here as an opportunity for all of our services to reopen. Um, we, we see our taxi service providers, our DMCs as well, and many of the agents operating here and at the airport, not, not to mention our accommodation sector as well. So really, on behalf of the, the sector, and certainly on my own behalf, we want to say welcome back to Air Canada, welcome back to the Canadian visitors, and this market is very important to our overall business here um, on the island as well. We hope that moving forward, that the demand will continue to increase and that we can see more increased demand coming into the future. Air Canada's winter schedule will include four weekly flights as of Christmas. St. Lucia is also set to welcome back WestJet and Sunwing in the weeks ahead. In 2019, St. Lucia welcomed over 40,000 Canadian visitor arrivals to the island. Keeping the destination and the diverse Canadian market top of mind, the St. Lucia Tourism Authority will continue to drive its robust, targeted marketing and public relations campaigns in the market, creating more awareness of the destination and access routes. Jorin Georges, St. Lucia Tourism Authority.